Okay, so if we've got two different websites, two different Shopify stores, and we just want to target two different language with, languages with each of them, and we want to manually add href lang tags into the head of the site, then this is how you do it. You go to your theme editor, go to theme.liquid, and then paste this code, which is in the top of the blog post, into there. What this is saying is, with this is a, this is on the English version of the website, so we've got one targeting English and one targeting France. This is saying that the English version, the canonical URL, is going to be our default option. This is also saying that the canonical URL is going to be our English option. And this is saying that for our French version, we want to replace the canonical URL with our hypothetical French website. And when you save it, this is what it looks like. As you can see, it's replaced the domain name with domain2.fr. And we've got our English and X default hreflang tags correctly added to the top here. Now, on the alternative French website, what would we would want to add is we would flip these two options here because the French website's canonical URL would be domain2.fr. So this would be French. This would be our English one. And then this would be replaced with the domain name of your English website. So say english.com. And remember, we want to keep the X default the same on all of them because the key thing about hreflang tags is that they must be identical on each version of the page.